on my last video, I talked about the key considerations for a prudent investment. We talked about taxes, inflation, and market volatility. We also talked about the four key retirement traps. The tax trap, we talked about the access trap, we talked about the distribution trap. And if you have not watched my last video, I will urge you to watch that video before coming to this so you get a better understanding. On the conclusion of my last video, I'd ask the question, what if you have a vehicle that can take care of taxes, take care of inflation, give you safeguards on market volatility? What if that same vehicle can avoid the tax trap for retirement, can avoid the access trap, can avoid the distribution trap. And that brings you to our topic for today. My best retirement investment vehicle, which is a maximum funded index universal life insurance policy. Your tax never is your Roth IRA because the money going to your Roth IRA is already taxed. So the money grows in tax-free a distribution you don't have to pay tax we look at municipal bonds and we look at life insurance because with the Roth IRA there are limits to how much you can contribute for 2020 the maximum you can put in is six thousand dollars and if you're 50 years and above you can only put in seven thousand dollars if you are a single tax filer your adjusted gross income has to be less than 139000 for you to be able to contribute to a Roth IRA. If you're married filing joint, your adjusted gross income has to be less than 206000 for you to be able to contribute to a Roth IRA. So a Roth IRA still has some restrictions. Municipal bonds is also a tax-free bucket. But the issue with municipal bonds is the interest you make on the bonds is tax-free, but the capital gains you make on municipal bonds as an investor, they are subject to alternative minimum tax, AMT. So municipal bonds also has some, although it's a tax-free bucket, but it also has some restrictions. The last tax-free bucket, which I called the miracle bucket, I call it the miracle fund. It is a life insurance policy, and the best life insurance policy is what we call the index universal life. Because the index universal life insurance policy was crafted for living benefits. Why is the IUL the base vehicle that beats taxes, beats inflation, takes care of market volatility, it avoids the tax, retirement tax trap, it avoids the access trap, it avoids the distribution trap, and it also avoids the debt benefit trap is because the IUL provides living benefits. And how is it structured? You can decide to link your IUL to an index. Let's say, for example, you decide to link it to the S&P 500 index. The S&P 500 index, for example, for the last 10 years, has averaged about 13.6%. This is what the insurance company will do. They will say, okay, since you want your money in a safe bucket, since you don't want to take any risk with your money, 
they will give you a cap at 10%. If the S&P 500 makes 20%, 25%, they will only credit you 10% on your money. But if the S&P 500 goes negative, they give you a floor of zero. So your money is always protected regardless. So you have that aspect of safety. Let's take an example here to see how your money works inside an index universal life insurance policy. In 2020, you start with $10,000. In 2021, you make 3%. 3% will be 10,300. That's a new principle. In 2022, the S&P goes minus 15%. Because you have a floor of zero, you still make 10,300. Because you're not losing. You have a floor of zero and a cap of 10. In 2023, the next year, the S&P makes 10%. Your principal, 10,300, will also make 10%. So we are looking at 11,330. In 2024, the S&P makes 20%. Remember, your cap is what? Your cap is 10%. You're only going to make 10% of this principle. In 2024, you make 12,463. In 2025, the S&P goes down 25%. You're still at the zero floor. You don't lose anything. So your principal is still capped at 12,463. Warren Buffett said there are two laws of investment. Number one, do not lose money. Law number two, do not forget law number one. This is how the IUL provides you liquidity, it provides you safety, and it provides you a good rate of return and of course the tax benefits. With an IUL, your money is not at risk because you have a cap and you have a floor. In 2008, when America witnessed the worst economic crisis, the American economy almost collapsed in 2008. People lost 40% of their investments. But guess what? A research found out that most banks they have about 40% of their liquidity and safety assets in bank-owned life insurance, what we call bully. So this is how the banks will invest your money in bank-owned life insurance companies and they make 5%, 10%, 10%, 20%, and they come back and they give you what? And they give you 0.00003% as interest. IUL is simply boycotting the middleman, the bank, and telling you, you can do this investment by yourself. You don't need the bank to do that to you. Because when the bank, when they do that, they keep 400% and they give you about 1% of it. So what happens to your money in an index universal life policy, that money is not invested in the market. That money is linked to the S&P 500. It is linked to the market. Each year, at the anniversary of your policy, the principle you have there is locked and reset. That's why in 2021, when you make 3%, your principal goes to 10,300. But in 2022, even when you, the S&P 500 is at negative 15, 
you still stay at 10,300 because that 10,300 was locked from the previous year. In 2023, when the market made 10%, it's 10% of the previous year and not 10% of your original investment. It goes through a strategy called lock and reset. And IUL is not an investment because an investment is subject to IRS rules of taxation. An IUL is a life insurance policy. Why will this money grow tax-free? Why would you access it tax-free? And why will you be able to transfer it tax-free? Let's look at three key provisions of the Internal Revenue Service Code. This is very important. IRS Code number 72E, it allows your money to accumulate tax-free inside a life insurance policy. And this is why the rich people they understand this and they maximize this. And that is why a, a maximum funded life index universal life insurance policy is the biggest tool the rich are using to do what? To tr transfer wealth, transfer to the next generation. They use it for working capital, okay? They use it for real estate investment because of the liquidity. They use it for college funding. The next provision is IRS code number 7702. It allows you access to that money while the money is growing. You don't have to wait until you are 59 and a half. You don't have to wait until, you're, until, until 70 and a half before you start accessing that money. No, it provides you those living benefits tax-free. You can have that money tied up somewhere in an annuity Tied up somewhere in an IRA or a 401k, something happened to you and you don't have access to that money. It is not liquid. But code number 7702 of the IRS, it allows you access to that money. Liquidity. IRS code number 101A, it says when you die, that money blossoms and transfers to your heirs tax-free. This is how we create generational wealth. This is how the rich set up their children to become millionaires before they get to age of 18. This is why an IUL is the best tool which beats taxes, it beats inflation, it beats market volatility, it's tax-free, it beats the four retirement traps, the tax trap, the access trap, the distribution trap, and the debt trap. In the money world, what we call the rule of 72 is how long your money would take in an investment to double on a fixed rate of return. If you divide 72 by the annual rate of return, it will tell you how many years it will take for that money to double. When you have your money at the bank or the CD, which is giving you 0.00003%, how long do you think that money will take to double? A very long time. But what do the banks, what do they do? The banks, they have their liquid and their growth, their safety assets in bank-owned life insurance uh, uh, companies. So what they do, they earn 5%, 10%, 15%, 20% on those investments and they come back and they pay you 0 0.003. So your money in their hands after 7, 8, 9 years, it doubles, it doubles, it doubles. And IUL gives you the opportunity to do the same thing for yourself without the bitter man and keep this for your family. That's why I call it the miracle fund. Nothing comes close to an IUL. A maximum funded index universal life insurance policy provides you 
the maximum living benefits. What are some of the living benefits? You can use it for retirement planning. No other vehicle comes close. You can use it for real estate management, liquidity. You want to invest in real estate, you have your money in an IUL, all you do is call your agent or call the insurance company, I need 100,000, I need 200,000, no questions asked. The access trap, the money is liquid, you get it and invest in your real estate. Working capital, you need money for your business. That your money in your IUL is there for you at any time. Emergency fund. Your strategic rollout can help you roll out money from your IRA or your 401k into your IUL. When you do a strategic rollout, you are paying the tax. You are saying, I want to take out that money today and pay the tax today so I don't have to pay that tax in the future. For an IUL for college education. See, an IUL beats a 529 college plan, hands down. Because a 529 college plan, that money is saved, tax deferred. And you only have to use it for college purposes. If the kid grow, your child grows up and gets a scholarship, then guess what? Because you are not using that money for college, then that money is taxable because it was tax deferred. But in an IUL, you can save for your kid's college in an IUL. And even if the kid grows up and gets a scholarship, you don't have to pay taxes on it because it's a tax-free bucket. So this beats the 529 plan hands down. I call it the miracle vehicle. I call it the magic vehicle because nothing comes close to a maximum funded index universal life insurance policy. If you see it as a life insurance policy, you will never get the picture. But if you see it as a vehicle that you can use for living benefits, tax-free buckets, if you understand IRS Code Section 101A, IRS Code Section 7702, IRS Code Section 72E, then you will do what the wealthy and the rich are doing. You will do what the banks are doing. Because me and you will put our money in the bank, and what the bank turns and do, they go and get these bank-owned life insurance policies where they keep 40% of their assets for safety, growth, and liquidity and they turn around and give me and you 0.00 percent while they are making a killing off of our money and iul is the only vehicle that gives you the opportunity to bypass the bank and make that money for yourself don't forget the money rule the rule of 72 how long it would take for your money to double you divide 72 by the rate of return and don't forget Warren Buffett, his two laws for investment. Law number one, never lose money. Law number two, do not forget law number one. So as you eat this Christmas, let this be a special gift for you and your families that 2021 will be a year where we decide to own our destinies and make more sound financial decisions. Because at C2C Mentors, is all about you, your family, and your family's finances because we care about you. It's been an incredible year. Thank you so much for all your support. We appreciate you sharing all of our content. And please subscribe, subscribe, and Merry Christmas from my family to your family. May God bless you all. Thank you.